It's Mountain West Conference hoops in the lovely Central Valley of California. Fresno State trying to stave off the hard-charging Broncos of Boise State. A team that's really found its groove over the last six games. Shot as well as he has in the past, but he is one of those heart and soul players of this team. Tough shot in the lane for the first bucket of the game here in Fresno. Kind of a unique offensive set there, and... Max Rice, he drives, he looks to pass. Everybody basically went back to their own man. He had a post up from two feet away. And a little runner as he's knocked to the ground from Isaiah Hill. Here's Rice again. This time it's blocked as he tries that same little move, gets it back and gets it to go. Then what they do. Five seconds on the shot clock. Get it over to Hill in the quarter. Pump fake has to let it rip and he does. Nice kick ahead pass there. Open look in the corner for Isaiah Pope off the mark. Stanley going right at Boachi on that one and it pays over to Boachi and then the loose ball gathered again by Boachi as he throws it down. Down to Isaiah Hill. And he drops it off, and it's thrown down by Enoch Boachi. Show and Andre and Boachi down low. They got a lot of options. Surprising to me that their numbers aren't better offensively. Cam Martin with the three-pointer. The Donovan Yap Jr. with these bright yellow shoes pulling from distance and hitting. Shooting confident the young man is, <laughs> and the deeper his offensive bag is. Inside to Max Rice, leading the way with six points for Boise. Oh, it is a classic. One of the great hockey movies of all time. Rice with Whoa. the tough shot somehow spins around and gets it to go. Sam Merrill didn't turn the ball over like that, though. Nice man. crossover by Yap as he drops it off for Bowatch. This is something we've seen a lot more of from Tyson Dagenhart. Ball tipped in there from Omar Stanley. Five defense in the country the last three years for Boise State. Yeah, number one scoring defense in the conference, but they're not stopping that. Enoch Bowachi dropping the hammer. Meadow with the top shot, and he's fouled the freshman from Santa Clarita, California. Off the bench, any offense they can get from him is such a bonus. Hill back out to Yap, who pulls the trigger and hits from three-point range. Three shot has to be a part of that. Taking hard on the drive and throws it down in traffic. Way more options. Six turnovers in the game already for Boise State. Driving, hanging, and hitting is Pope. Megan Hart spinning and double team kicks it out to Martin. Good nice. passing by the Broncos here, and it pays Abo from the corner. And there's Abo again from 17 feet in the conference. They are so solid. Abo, one dribble, and drills the three-pointer with the hand in his face. In the most bizarre stat I've ever come across this season, Abo shoots better when he is guarded from the three-point line than he does when he is wide open. I, it, it's weird, I know, but trust me, it's true. Take a look at the numbers. Little pump fake for Weaver and the drive gets the tough layup to fall and rips it away for the steal. And how about that pass from Hill to Weaver? Again, okay, he's wide open. So off the front see. of the rim, you're right. Maybe they're going to stop guarding him. Max Rice with a hand in the face and he's hitting from distance for the Broncos. Their fifth defensive rebound for Fresno State. Nice drive by Yap. As so far, no. They're getting crushed on the board, 17 to eight. Jace Whiting hits from distance. Back to a 13 point lead for Boise State in the Mount West Conference the last couple years. Leon Rice talked about it. 
Nice little dump off pass there by Yap at home. Down double digits most of the half. If they can get that stop and maybe get it to single nice. digits. Anderson with his second. Actually, his first bucket of the game. His first two points came from the free throw line. Gets it off at the buzzer, and he hits Isaiah Pope. Making it a 10-point ball game as both teams head into the locker room. Yeah, offensively on the first possession, what they want to try and establish here in the second half. Here's a cutting Anderson. Great look from Omar Stanley. And it's Jalen Weaver who's starting the second half for Fresno State. Did not start the game. Nice little reverse layup there from Isaiah Pope. Drew a spin on that one from underneath. Like Pope's game. Here's Rice with the runner. And starting the second half, just like he finished. Him and, and Isaiah Hill, those two have brought it. And there is Boachi on the dunk of the iron. Abo hanging and hitting. Get enough credit. Another great pass by Hill. This time it's Eduardo Andre with the finish. A couple of players like that for Fresno State, including Hill, who's been dealing with a thumb injury. Getting a little bit healthier as the season goes on as Roddy Anderson hits the short jumper. Again, it's a 12-point lead for Boise State. Now even Fresno State's head coach, Justin Hudson, has missed the last two games because of illness. They've had a rough go of it having a full roster on the floor. Pope drills it. He is left-handed. Omar did allow him to get to that strong hand. And speaking Ooh. of, there is Omar Stanley with another three-pointer. Good ball movement by Fresno State. Hill spinning in the lane. Making it look easy is Isaiah Hill. Here's Stanley. He was thinking about dropping it oh. off to Rice, but how about pulling from distance again? Why not? Three last game, two here tonight. I ain't kind of making an exaggeration there, but the last couple of games, if you haven't watched Boise State play, you'd think that Omar Stanley was the best player as Isaiah Hill. It's a nice one to go. Shots that he's missed. Stanley with the pump fake and the impossible reverse. At the beginning... Here's Hill with the runner. And for their last four from the field, they haven't scored in the last 207. And that changes right here with a nice pass to Jace Whiting. Or whether he was going to shoot or pass and then get the ball knocked away. Hill pulls up and hits. Four. And then the steal and the layup from Colomario. Here's Jap. Hits. We talked about getting the single digits, and here we are. Game case. Yeah, see how much more active, right? You see the ball go through the net for the Bulldogs, and now they're flying all over the floor defensively. Wow. Open cutter. Dagenhart. Gets lost there, five. Down by six, chance to make it a one possession game. And they do, Xavier Ducell with the three. Six, Boise State doesn't have a field goal in the last three minutes. And the rebounding battle, they're finally starting to get stops and then grabbing the defensive board. Hill hits. We're tied up at 66. Isaiah Hill getting big. His first three-pointer of the game, he now has 15, and we are all knotted up. Who steps up for Boise State? That is the question. You would say get the ball to Tyson Dagenhart, but he's just two for seven. Here he's got the ball now. Two for seven from the field. Shot clock at two. Rice has to heave it up. Not a great possession for Boise State. And Fresno State with a chance to take the lead. It looked like nobody in a Bronco uniform really wanted to take that shot. Hey, hey, hey. 
Here's Hill, guarded by Roddy Anderson. Over to Yap. They're the two leading scorers. Yap on the drive, left-handed, and the Bulldogs are up. Up two with two to go. My goodness, what a game here tonight. Two minutes to go. Boise State needs a spark. Down by two. Over to the corner. Abo can't hit. But Boise State comes up with the loose ball. <laughs> That's Max Rice again. He seems to be lurking in the shadows. Abo from the corner. Got it. Huge three for Abo. Boise State back in the lead. Ends the scoring drought. 130 to go. Can Fresno State answer? Hill or Yap. Yeah. Hill or Yap have to be the decision makers here. Yap with the ball now. 10 seconds on the shot clock. Also, watch the offensive glass. Yap loses the ball, dribbles it off his foot. Here's Dagenhart going to pull it back out. One point ball game, under a minute to go. Boise State clinging to a one point lead, up by 16 just nine minutes ago. Fresno State in a 1 3 1 for this possession. Five seconds on the shot clock. Dagenhart from deep. And the rebound back to Stanley goes up, and he's fouled on the shot by Ducell. The throw shooter is Stanley on the season. Makes is this. Fresno State does not need a three. Attack the rim. Pick and roll. Isaiah Hill. Get in the paint. And we have seen it so many times tonight. Isaiah Hill guarded by Rice. Taking a lot of time. This is Ducell. Little sloppy on this offensive possession. Eight seconds on the shot clock. Here's Yap to Ducell, deep three. Rebound to Boise State. And Fresno State has to foul. One made free throw here, and this game likely is over. In and out. It ain't over no. yet. I think they... Yep. They, they fouled on purpose. Timeout? They fouled. No, they fouled on purpose. Most coaches that you'll talk to, not all, expect a foul on the bounce. They call backcourt? Backcourt violation. Oh, my goodness. What a huge mistake from the Bulldogs. That ball's tipped, but now he has possession. That's absolutely the right Clearly. call. Yep. Clearly. Xavier Ducell, he... So you have to foul here on the inbounds. And now just 2.7 seconds to go. Bummer for Fresno State. They have really battled here in the second half, the final 10 minutes of the game. Keeping it close, taking the lead at one point for the first time. And that will do it here for Boise State. As Rice hits the first. They'll get one final shot attempt, and Boise State holds on for a spirited and hard-fought win on the road. It's Stanley with 14, and Abo and Rice leading the way with 16 apiece. Third straight road win for the Broncos, the first time they have done that since the 21-22 season, and man, they had to earn every bit of it here. Road wins in this conference this season are worth their weight in gold. It was an uneven performance from Boise State, to be sure, right? They started to walk away or run away with this one and then immediately let Fresno State, a tough, old, experienced team, right back in. But when it's all said and done, a road win is a road win. It goes in, in that column, and Boise State moves on. And that sets up a showdown with Utah State in Boise on Saturday. Utah State coming in, ranked 18th in the country. The Broncos looking to take them down. Thanks for joining us, everybody. For Casey Jacobson, I'm Dan Helley. Have a great night.